this device manages to emulate all of these items that allow us to take get random random numbers. It emulates each one of these particular types of dice, it emulates a coin flip, it emulates drawing a card. It also does a few other functions. It allows you to generate hexadecimal numbers, it allows you to generate binary numbers, and it allows you to generate passwords. When first turned on, this device is in a mode to emulate a standard six-sided die. You use this button, the roll button, to actually roll the die. To change the mode you're in, you press and hold the mode button for one second. In this mode, the coin mode, the device emulates the flipping of any particular coin. After the coin mode, the device will emulate a, a four-sided die. The next mode after the four-sided die is an eight-sided die. The next mode after the, the eight sided die is a ten sided die. Since we only have a single digit, the ten is represented by a zero. The next mode after the 10-sided die is a 12-sided die. And since this one requires more than two digits to display, it will only roll a single die as opposed to the previous mode, which we rolled two of each, or two of the The next mode after the 12 sided die is a 20 sided die. Again, like the last, it will only roll a single die. The next mode after the 20 sided die is to simulate a single deck of 52 standard playing cards. After drawing all 52 cards, it will reshuffle and allow you to start again. The remaining three modes do not have a direct correlation to a physical me mechanism for generating random numbers, um, but they are quite useful for, for um, some occasional purposes. The next mode after card is hexadecimal numbers. It will display a single hexadecimal number. The next mode after a hexadecimal number is binary. It will display 16 binary numbers.
the next and last mode after binary is password. It will generate a random password of eight characters. The characters can be lowercase, uppercase, number, or a plus or minus. Unlike the others, it will actually display the password slowly across the uh, two displays. The idea is to give you time to actually write the password down.